Welcome to the show buzz with our eye on what's new at the movies. This week sees an old classic getting a modern makeover, but the results aren't necessarily pretty. <gasps> what was that? French kiss. Really? Because the French always surrender. That was decidedly German. Russell Brand inhabits a role originally made iconic by Dudley Moore in Arthur. He plays a drunken billionaire given the ultimatum to shape up and marry the right woman, played by Jennifer Garner, or risk losing everything. Helen Mirren as his long-suffering nanny in a role that originally won Sir John Gielgud an Oscar as the butler is the only bright spot in this otherwise pretty mediocre comedy. And Dilly. A beautifully shot documentary highlighting the plight slum dwellers in India face as a result of being driven out of their homes to make way for the 2010 Commonwealth Games and the man trying to rebuild their lives one home at a time. I felt there needs to be a, a film that can be seen by people across the world as to how the underprivileged were hurt in the process of in that one man's development can, be, can result in another person's homelessness and that's what truly happened here. Switching gears now to an IMAX 3D extravaganza you'll want to take the whole family to see. Born to be Wild features narration by Morgan Freeman and documents the extraordinary efforts of two women, Dr. Barut Galdicus and Dr. Dame Daphne Sheldrick, who devoted their lives to rescuing and raising orphaned animals in the wild. I recently sat down with Dr. Galdicus, a world-renowned primatologist, and spoke to her about the documentary and her work. First off, this documentary is visually stunning. I was watching it and I immediately felt transposed into the rainforest of Borneo. Tell me, were you happy with the way it turned out? I was actually thrilled with the way that the film turned out. Normally, trailers are better than the film, but in this case, the film was actually better than the trailer. And for more of my interview with Dr. Galdicus, and for a complete review of Born to be Wild, stay with CBSNews.com. And that's the buzz for now. In New York, I'm Karina Mitchell.